Leadership Foundation is a foundation that works on leadership, empowering us and giving us an education that we as the youth of South Africa need. You know, when we started MAD, we didn't see this. Uh, with a bunch of friends, when I started it, we thought five, maybe ten. Now close to 200 have already gone through school and university. We could have, in the community I come from, just chosen to accept that I was born in this place. This is where I'll die, in a shack. There's nothing more to me. There's nothing more for me. This is just the way things are. But we didn't. As individuals, we decided that we will actively shape this future. I do believe that this is an incredible opportunity for a young person to be able to grow and learn not just the academics, but also what it truly means to be a leader in current world context, where we see a, a crisis in leadership in many ways. We are getting important information about empathy, communication, collaboration. And the theme this year is the DNA of collaboration, which is something that I think each and every one of us needs. I'm so proud to work with the Make a Difference Foundation. And the talent that I see when I work with the scholars here is just phenomenal. I've heard from so many of them interacting with the material I've been teaching around communication and their ideas are profound. Because if you can't listen, why do you expect people to listen when you speak? So I leave inspired. I leave just so joyful and so full of hope because this is where our future lies. I knew of MAD through a colleague, Alan Kerrins in Ireland, who had worked with Talette. And I'd heard of MAD and the, and the mission of Francois Pinard. But I was struck by the fact that here's somebody who's using their generosity to set up the foundation, as Mandela told him, to make a difference. And actually, you know, from what I've seen of it, it makes a massive difference. It's a, it's a life-changing opportunity for a young person. But what I really like about the mission in MAD is the way it respects what young, where young people are at, guides them, mentors them, and lets them, you know, fulfill their own potential. It's not about what MAD telling them what to do. It's about MAD opening the door for them to have great opportunities. But the idea that they were providing guidance, mentorship, the whole series of things, from a young age all the way through university. I'm not aware of any other foundations that have been doing that level of, of commitment and time. So the impact is just absolutely massive. I've really, really, really felt the support of MAD even through COVID-19 and a lot of things changing in my life and just knowing that I have people who believe in me and people who want to see me succeed and even in times where I've had moments of doubting myself or just even thinking that I don't deserve this, like I've had people who are like, we believe in you and we support you. MAD has been there through all the challenges, academic and personal, as well as just doing everything that uh, I just want to cry. MAD provides support on a personal level, whether it's emotional issues you're dealing with, there's always a coordinator who's willing to take a call, or maybe it's academic, there's, uh, there's always programs if you're struggling academically. Any support you could, you could possibly require, it's provided by MAD. Realize me, like, the work that the scholarship has done for me, and being reminded, I hope, seeing how much I've grown and how much Matt has literally supported me from being one, like wanted to grab my physios since grade eight, no, since grade seven, yeah, until I today know. it's like I'm doing my final year and it just feels so surreal that I'm actually like living my dream essentially. The Matt staff, nothing but the light and love I have for them, the support that they have, the things that they go through for us, I can't thank them enough. And it's been amazing to see you grow from that great team, young woman looking forward to all these great things and now you've achieved so many of them. And watching you in the sessions, Nomsa, we were speaking about it yesterday. We're so proud of you and so impressed with you because your contributions have been really valuable. And I think you're setting a great example to the younger girls in the room because now they're aspiring to be like you. So you're setting a great example. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. My message is, there's help here. We've got a great team. I cannot tell you how proud I am. 
So it really is for me an honor to be here with you. I think I'm where I'm at because someone did something that positively changed my life and I want to do that for the next person and they might do that for the other person and it's like a butterfly effect where one small change leads to a bigger change. The honesty, the authenticity of our young leaders, it's emotional because we're delving deep into what society should be in a country that is a rainbow nation, in a country that's got issues that we need to deal with. And it's these young leaders that's going to change it. So for everybody that supported MAD, that have invested into these young leaders, if you see what I saw today and if you listen to what I've heard and the intense debates, is your investment is really reaping benefits.